Welcome to Loreto, Mexico, known for its crystal clear waters and jagged rock formations. Now this video will provide 10 reasons why people love Loreto. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to Loreto, Mexico. Population around 450,000. Now just for context, we have a map here. We have circled Loreto. Loreto is four hours from La Paz and six hours from Cabo St. Lucas. Now this video will provide 10 reasons why people love Loreto. People love Loreto because of Tabor Canyon Trail Hike. This hike in the Loreto, Mexico area is considered to be of moderate difficulty and is among the locals' favorites. It is fairly short, but some bouldering over rocks is required, so remember to bring a good pair of hiking shoes. If that doesn't entice you, you'll be glad to know there's a nice waterfall included on your hiking route to make it worthwhile. Not to mention the route itself is quite sufficiently alluring with its scenery, so bring your camera. People love Loreto because of the golf at TPC Danzante Bay. This 18-hole course is located at the Villa del Palmar Resort and Spa, which is known to be one of the most terrific spots in all of Loreto to stay in or generally spend time in. The challenging course is well regarded for its amazing panoramic views of not only Danzante Bay, but many other of the natural hotspots in Loreto, notably the Sea of Cortez, the Five Islands of Loreto, and the Sierra de la Gigante mountain range. It's truly one of a kind to play golf, allowing you to enjoy desert, mountain, and ocean backdrops all at once. Even if golf isn't typically your game of choice, you'll wanna play here. If for nothing else, then to just get a peek at the signature hole, number 17, that's green juts out into the Sea of Cortez. It's a stunner from every angle. People love Loreto because of the whale watching. Another spectacular not to miss thing to do while in Loreto, Mexico is to go whale watching. There are as many as eight different whale species that love to swim around Loreto, so you're in for quite the treat. Your best bet to go whale watching in Loreto is between December and March with Loreto Coastal Expeditions and Loreto Sea and Land Tours offering some of the best excursions available, taking you out to the whale's favorite spot in the Sea of Cortez. People love Loreto because of Mission Loreto. This is a beautiful church located right in the center of Loreto that's worth visiting and snapping a photo of, at least from the outside. Inside, it is fairly small and simple in interior, although nevertheless quite charming, especially if you're a history buff or in general want to get a deeper understanding or insight of the town that you're visiting. This church is not to be missed as its history dates back all the way to the 1600s. People love Loreto because of Isla Coronado. Isla Coronado is a small island right off the Baja California shoreline, known not only for its white sand beaches, but the volcano at its northern end, which, while has not held any activity since the 1500s, offers an impressive addition to the scenery of the island, especially along the west side. You can find beautiful white sand beaches to walk along and even dip into the crystal clear waters for a swim. Once you see just how beautiful and translucent the waters by the bay of Isla Coronado are, you'll immediately understand why it's the most beloved of Loreto's islands. People love Loreto because of the snorkeling at Danzante Island. The only inhabitants of this part of Loreto, Mexico are the reptiles and seabirds on land, as well as the tropical fish and other sea animals in the sea. This area is nationally protected by UNESCO and an official part of Loreto Bay National Marine Park. So you can expect plenty of beautiful things to see when you snorkel in these waters. Beyond the colorful tropical fish, you may get lucky enough to spot some bottlenose dolphins, manta rays and sea turtles as well. On a tour with Danzante Tours, for example, you get to enjoy the fun of snorkeling, on top of which you'll enjoy finding out about some of the secrets and features and history of the area as you are sailing towards the best spot for snorkeling. People love Loreto because of the Twilight LED paddle boarding. If you want to add some unique touch to your trip to this part of Baja, California, then head over to Villa del Palmar Resort for some paddle boarding. Though paddle boarding itself may be a familiar concept to you, 
Many of us have tried this fun activity by now. How many of you have already done it at nighttime? During this particular activity, you'll go out after dark and hop on a paddleboard equipped with LED lights. Not only is it a unique take on paddleboarding, but you're going out there when much of the marine life is at its most active, attracting them towards you and your board's LED lights illuminating the water surface like the moon. Kayaks are also available for those who prefer. People love Loretto because of the Loretto Malacon. Who doesn't love a walk along the Malacon? The Loretto Malacon is a waterfront area where you can walk along the promenade, taking in the gorgeous ocean views around you. It's a relaxing afternoon stroll to have, easy to complete with some local treats, people watching, or even shopping, in addition to which it's entirely possible to see some dolphins, stingrays, or whales in the water. So remember to keep your eyes open for magical water wildlife while you're there. Also find yourself along the Melicon at least once during the sunset to catch that postcard worthy photo which you might just make a copy of and print out as an actual postcard and photo of yourself. People love Loretto because of the Outback Desert Tour on an ATV. To pump up some adrenaline into your adventure in the Baja California Sur, take the ATV tour offered by Danzante Tours. They're excellent at covering the basics of how to drive an ATV if you're a beginner. Before setting off on a tour that explores through the Baja Desert, the beachfront, and the town of Ligui, offering you incredible views of Loreto and the Sea of Cortez as you speed around, there will be plenty of stops taken along the way so that you can properly take in all the beautiful nature that you're seeing and so that you can snap a hundred photos or so. For some, this is a favorite thing to do in Loreto. People love Loreto because of the day trip to San Javier Mission. Located on the Baja California region, San Javier Mission is a world famous Spanish missionary church, gorgeous inside and out, offering some great Baroque architecture, painted art and a piece of local history for its visitors. It's a fairly short drive from Loreto and if you go by car, you'll enjoy how scenic the route there and back is. Just remember to head out on your day trip early enough to make it back before dark as the road might get tricky to navigate throughout the night. The reasons provided in this video are not all the reasons why people love Loretto. If you've got a reason why you love Loretto, pop it in the comments section. I'll make another video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Ciao for now!